ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದ ನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರುಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವಲ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತುರ್ವಶುಖಿಪಿಂಧುವ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿನ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂ ಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಜತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬಿಂದಾವೈ ತುಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಶ್ರೀ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂ ಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಭರ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೋಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಂಜನು ತರನ್ ಭೀರ್ತಾಹಂ ಪುನತುಪಾಲ್ಭವದ್ದಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಿಂದ ಯಾದಪಲ್ಲವನ ಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫೋರ್ಜಿತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪವಧೂಷ್ವಧರ್ಷ ಪುನಾನುರಾಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂಕರೋಷ್ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದ್ವೈತಗಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ ಹರೆ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೆ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕ ಬದಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನ ಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯಥಾಕ್ಷ ವೈಶಾಂಬರೋ ದ್ವಿಜವರೋ ಜುಗಧಾರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯ ಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ರಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟ ಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತ್ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷು ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಿ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀರ್ ತ್ವಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ 
हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नैवोप नैव पयती अपचिति कवयोस्तवेश ब्रह्मायुषा कृत मृद मृदमुदो स्मर तो जो अंतर्बिस्तनुभृता अशुभम विधुन्वन आचार्य चैतवपुषा सगति बनती नैवोपयतीपचिति कवयोस्तवेश ब्रह्मायु ब्रह्मायुषा कृत मृद मृदो स्मर जो अंतर्बिस्तनुभृता अशुभम विधुन्वन आचार्य चैतवपुषा सगति मेनक्ति गौरी गोष्ठीपति गौरी गोष्ठीपति शिशिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमंश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट श्री कृष्ण नाम जस्ट बाय टेकिंग एट द टाइम ऑफ टेकिंग कृष्ण नाम दैट श्री कृष्ण अनुशीलन इज ऑल द टाइम गेटिंग इन साइड अस बाय द गुरु कृपा भगवान इज कमिंग इन द फॉर्म ऑफ गुरुदेव and he is actually helping us in the form of gurudev and he's come in this material world swayam bhagwan has come and he has just came as uh, in the form of parmatma he is coming inside our heart and he is just uh, helping us to get out of this material bondage all the time that is the actual uh, effort of uh, bhagwan to just get us out of the material bondage inside our heart in the form of parmatma he is actually guiding us to get out of the material bondage prabhupada actually speaking that she at the time of taking shri krishna naam that to do a krishna anushilan is is all the time possible for us under the under the anugatya if you are, you are not doing anugatya then it is not at all possible to do krishna naam krishna naam is always uh, done under the anugatya of guru pure guru vaishnav and just to do karam phal bhog what you are actually getting the karam phal that kind of desire what is there that kind of mukti pipasha what is there inside your heart automatically it will just get destroyed and the shri naam has so much uh, effect and shri naam has so much effect that the jiva can get out of different kind of anarthas slowly steadily he will be getting out of the anarthas slowly steadily all the anarthas will go away and uh, those that krishna naam in the form of that krishna naam those that is the actual bhajan pathway if you are just following that that is swayam shri krishna that name that is krishna it is not different from each other that what is naam that is shri krishna himself that with full nishta when you are doing krishna naam otherwise nothing will happen at all that without in without any aparadh it means that by bhagwan bhagwan shri krishna and naam is swayam his swayam roop and is not different from each other bhagwan shri krishna and swayam naam is uh, one and the same that swayam shri krishna and bhagwan is not different from each other the name and bhagwan shri krishna nandanandan shri krishna is swayam roop bhagwan that sachida sachidanandan krishna is swayam roop and other and other we are actually speaking swayam that bhagwan is swayam swayam roop what do you, what do you mean by swayam roop that this is the original cause of all causes that he is the actual cause of all the causes and apart from that there is no one there 
that we are speaking in in this swayam roop bhagwan when it is there nandan nandan shri krishna apart from that that dwarka das krishna i am not at all speaking i am not at all speaking about mathura das krishna i am speaking about nandan nandan shri krishna swayam that when prabhupad speaking that shri naam is swayam shri krishna he is not swayam he is that swayam roop naam prabhupad actually speaking that that we are actually very much ill luck is there for us that we can't understand this point at all that that we have so much ill luck in order to just get rid of that ill luck we don't have any kind of uh, other uh, other pathway is not at all open for us we that kind of durdaivya in order to just get rid of that durdaivya we don't have any kind of other pathway open for us that naam bhajan is the top most that lot of time prabhupad has just told this point already and already written this point as well that no who actually wants to hear all this siddhant which are someone should be there who can hear this siddhant which are shri krishna naam bhajan the, the apart from shri krishna naam bhajan there is no other pathway open for us shri krishna naam anand Shri, the kind of anand which we are getting in shri krishna naam that we are just jumping like that in anand that we just need to that what kind of material bondage is there that material anand is there we just need to get rid of that material bondage that by krishna naam anand that what kind of anand we are getting in krishna naam that kind of anand that kind of material anand automatically that uh, kind of sadness or unhappiness or in order to just uh, take that uh, vasana it automatically will get removed krishna bhogya amanitur pe krishna priti prito hoya ama ke akarshan karne se just by getting attracted to krishna naam it means it it is written here that uh, that what is actually satisfying krishna that the actual nitya swarup of ours that is to serve and to satisfy krishna in order to get the actual priti of krishna in that swarup only i am actually getting attracted to that nitya swarup of krishna like the actual swarup of roop manjari krishna becoming mad by seeing the actual swarup of roop manjari why because the actual seva swarup of roop manjari this not this material swarup of male and female this conception is not at all coming here roop manjari is the actual swarup of uh, roop manjari is like that that krishna become mad by seeing that and our so much top most swarup beautiful swarup if krishna will be getting attracted to us and krishna is getting attracted towards us then by just getting darshan of that automatically that is only we require in our life we only require this thing only that we just need to get uh, attracted towards krishna should get attracted towards us this is the top most thing what we need in the rupa nubdhara that what we are actually discussing here that the actual uh, discussion we are discussing here that automatically if you are actually speaking it in a round manner then this is rupa nub bhakti this is actually rupa nub bhakti no what it is kama nuga the or the which are i have already told you kama nuga bhakti रागात्मिक भक्ति एंड आफ्टर दैट रागानुगा भक्ति एंड आफ्टर दैट दैट काम रूपा संबंध रूपा ऑल आई हैव ऑलरेडी डिस्कस दैट एंड आफ्टर दैट दैट राग वतम चंद्रिका इन दिस ओनली दैट कामानुगा भक्ति इज डिस्क्राइब्ड एंड ओनली दैट विषय इज ऑल ओनली डिस्क्राइब्ड इन दैट इट मींस दैट द परिक्या भाव दैट व्हाट गोपिकाज आर फीलिंग अट्रैक्शन फॉर कृष्णा that is actually rupanu bhajan only that is rupanu gadhara shila narottam das thakur ji has already written
दैट भगवान शुड वी शुड गेट द कृपा ऑफ शील रूप गोस्वामी पाद just by taking the lotus feet we just were taking the actual support of lotus feet of that uh, shila roop goswami pad that kalyug pavan avatar is shri krishna chaitanya mahaprabhu that that top most antarang parshad shila roop goswami pad that we already know that that shila roop goswami pad that actually what he has just written that etc all the shlokas what shila roop goswami pad has uh, already written that all kind of shlokas which have been written by shila roop goswami pad mahaprabhu become very much uh, surprised and feeling amazed by seeing that kind of anand and what he speaking that uh, that that the actual hidden treasure what is there inside my heart how he actually is understanding that mahaprabhu speaking that the actual hidden treasure secrecy of prema towards krishna how actually rup goswami pad has just learned that from my heart what is the how actually is getting that hint so after that we can just understand that shri larup goswami pad shri larup manjari he is the actual nitya antarang nijajan of mahaprabhu and shri kavi karanpur and shri kavi karanpur goswami in shri chaitanya chandroday natak drama he has written in the ninth adhyay he has written it means that gorang mahaprabhu that their actual swarup they have a very topmost swarup of their own it's not like that that daitya swarup is there and it's not like that that prem swarup is also there and after that there is a natural swarup also there that what mahaprabhu is possessing the actual natural uh, inclined swarup is also there and the actual swarup of mahaprabhu the actual swarup of mahaprabhu that gorang swarup he is actually taking and is speaking ha krishna ha krishna and is doing seva that kind of uh, bhav actually mahaprabhu is actually exhibiting in that if we can just see that nij anurup nij anurup means that mahaprabhu's what the actual treasure bhav is there inside mahaprabhu that is the actual thing manifestation that is actual manifestation and that shila roop ko swami roop manjari that that shila roop ko swami pad that tompost vilas that sadhan we can do under the guidance of shila roop pad only that by the guidance of shila roop ko swami pad we can only get the actual treasure of uh, radha govind leela and but in bhakti rasamrit sindhu before writing that shila roop ko swami pad has uh, given that topmost topmost merciful uh, attitude he has just uh, uh, and he is just uh, in a very uh, unhappy mood he is speaking in front of us that you see so much merciful attitude he is showing with this kind of merciful attitude humble attitude that what is the actual position of rupa goswami pad krishna das kaviraj goswami pad in chaitanya chritamrit has written as shown so much humble attitude that you can't even imagine jagai madhai so this is the actual humble attitude and lot of actually shlokas are there regarding this humble attitude they have just manifested that each and every place they have manifested this kind of humble attitude 
and in the other place also it is written In each and every place it is written like that. That Vrindavan Das Thakur Mahashe on to the lotus feet of Vrindavan Das Thakur all the time they, he has shown the Anugatya that of my Chaitanya Chiritamrit what I am writing that what Thakurji has given me the actual uh, manifestation to write this so that I could I should have that topmost humble attitude and uh, uh, that topmost prema I should get from this that's why all the time he is actually just uh, speaking like that on to the lotus feet of Vrindavan Das Thakur Krishnadas Kaviraj actually just uh, making a humble request so like Srila Vrindavan Das whatever I am actually writing I am uh, just writing on the consent and kripa of Srila Vrindavan Das Thakur whatever the actually the uchist the actual uchist what has uh, uh, chewed by Vrindavan Das Thakur I am just chewing that uchist only I don't have anything of my own that so much hum- humble attitude he is showing Krishna Das Kaviraj so in this way that humble mood is the topmost uh, pathway for the uh, bhajan mood it is not a normal thing for Raghavatam Chandrika in order to just get established in Raghavatam Chandrika we just need to prove our eligibility that whether we are capable or eligible to do Rag, uh, Rag Bhajan or not so that's why Srila Rupa Goswami Path has written by the actual uh, guidance of that that inside our heart that by the guidance of that person that by that guidance that we are actually just like a poor person we are actually most fallen we are in the most fallen condition that this Sri Bhakti Granth we are actually unable to write that Bhakti Granth we are actually just standing in front of that in order to write that Bhakti Granth just by taking the kripa of this uh, uh, Mahajans only, Mahaprabhu actually just speaking to Srila Rupa Goswami Pad that about this bhakti, the actual secret Siddhanta of bhakti, that kind of rasatatta is actually spoken by Mahaprabhu to Srila Rupa Goswami Pad and not like that, but also just uh, speak, just uh, uh, doing kripa by taking his hand on Srila Rupa Goswami Pad's head and speaking and uh, that Srila Guru Goswami Pada so much topmost beautiful Sondarya that Srila Sanatan that Srila Sanatan Goswami who is the Swayam Guru of uh, Rupa Goswami Pada he is actually speaking that I am actually Rupanug he actually giving his title that I am Rupanug now you can understand what is the condition of Sanatan Goswami Pada he actually used to introduce himself as Rupanug so what is the actual Vishay you can understand this is not a normal ordinary joking what you are thinking this is not one kind of joking. Those who can just uh, give, be showing that much uh, humble attitude in his life, he'll be getting that topmost uh, uh, realization regarding that seva and he will be getting more and more happiness in seva. Yesterday, I was actually discussing this point and we have just seen that point. Observing that, that uh, in Bhagavad Dharma, that Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, from Chaitanya Mahaprabhu up till Srila Rupa Goswami Pad, Srila Rupa Sanatan and up till Srila Rautam Das Thakur has just told uh, all together this one point in uh, that is the Bhagavad Mahaprabhu is the Bimal, Bimal uh, pram, Praman, the actual uh, Praman and uh, Narottam Das Thakur also has written that uh, Vichar Kariyamane, this is a very in-depth analysis is there in that, what he wants to speak, that Vichar Kariyamane, Vichar Kariyamane means that whatever our previous Mahajans and our previous Guru Varg has told, by that, on that basis of that, that Vichar, our Vichar is actually standing. This I already been told. 
that but just by speaking bhagavad dharm that is equivalent to atma dharm yesterday we have already seen that shila vishnu chakravarti pad has just uh, opened this point in front of us and has just told just by closing your eyes if you are actually he can just get into this fallen condition he don't have any chance to get fallen from this bhakti pathway but we just need to take the ashray of bhagavad dharma when you haven't taken the ashray of bhagavad dharma you haven't taken the shelter of bhagavad dharma if someone actually is thinking that he has already taken diksha is yes, is that he has taken ashray of bhagavad dharma it is not like that to just take the ashray of bhagavad dharma that i am actually uh, of no support and only shrimad bhagavad ji mahapra is my only support whatever money power position minister police whatever power we have material power we don't have any kind of faith on that so ashray in order to take the actual shelter when actually the question of coming actual shelter where that question is coming how we can get that shelter what kind of shelter we need that is actually very much important to think that those who are in actually that they have taken the ashray of bhagavad dharma in their life it is possible jano asthayu jano asthayu noru rajan no pramadit karishi dhavan nimillu vane treno skolit navadit it doesn't mean that uh, we have already have taken the shelter of bhagavad dharma we are so that we will already actually have established in bhagavad dharma it's not like that we have just taken the ashray of bhagavad dharma by taking ashray what will happen that all kind of normal material uh, rules and regulations and vedic rules and regulations and all sanskar everything he is actually following just by following that upeksha means that uh, upeksha is not at all uh, forcible it is automatically what actually it's told there prabodhanan saraswati was what he's telling that up till that point we are actually liking this brahma katha tavad mukti padavi aha mukti padavi this actually we will be liking up till what point tavad brahma katha mukti padavi tavad na tikti bhave tab tak ye up till that point it will not uh, fi- it will not we will not be finding it tasteless up till what point when uh, we are actually under the guidance of gorang mahaprabhu that kind of rag varma chandrika we are actually established we are actually established in rupa nugdhara that we are actually getting the association of rasik bhakt up till that point we will be finding it very tasteful we will not be finding it tasteless it will find us very uh, lot of happiness for us shila sant goswami maharaj always used to speak that up till that you are not at all getting padma madhu up till that uh, thing you will be just liking good good means uh, jaggery but when you will be getting the higher taste then you will not be uh, finding uh, jaggery as sweet if you are getting the topmost taste more than jaggery then the that taste will be more better than jaggery you will be finding that and you will not find jaggery as more tasteful than that, than that and in that case that in uh, actual swarup you will be just taking the actual shelter of bhagavad dharma by that's why narottam das thakur actually speaking ashray lena is uh, not a big thing if you haven't taken any ashray then what is the use you have to take ashray those who have just taken the shelter of bhagavad dharma then they will definitely be getting out of this material world that they will also be just doing a lot of uh, rules and regulations are there of this material world and a lot of stoppage and prohibitions are there and prabodhan saraswati pad actually speaking
that all kind of material rules and regulations whatever are the symptoms of this that all these rules and regulations when you will be just not following that you will be just get uh, a lot of uh, insult from the material world so when you are not at all having any kind of uh, uh, restriction if you are not at all following of this material world and you are not at all feeling any taste for the actual position what will be required for that you will be just finding it one kind of uh, barrier in uh, the gate of krishna bhajan if uh, in the uh, like uh, if this kind of bhav like gopikas they are finding the one barrier in front of the krishna bhajan then whatever the rules and regulations of this material world and restrictions are there they are actually or useless in the in the way of krishna bhajan they are actually just like one dangerous barrier because they are naturally getting attracted towards krishna that they actually naturally are getting attracted that they are actually doing all the time spontaneous seva of the lotus feet of bhagwan and they actually are not stopping themselves from that if no kind of actually restriction or barrier can stop them like the case of gopikas you can see that bhagwan shri krishna has actually openly told us uh, told in front of us this point Previously, he was telling that na pare aham. That like demigods, that we are getting a very uh, uh, long age. Still, we can't do anything for your seva. That you are by your own kripa, you are by your own seva, you are getting uh, happy and satisfied. That's why you are satisfied by your own seva. That in this material world, when you are actually just uh, coiling it and destroying all the rules and regulations of material world, you are not at all following that the prohibitions of material world, and you have just taken the shelter with completely uh, seva mood, full com seva mood. You are actually uh, taken this kind of uh, uh, effort to do the seva. that i can't pay you for that bhagwan already speaking to gopikas the what actually the material rules and regulations and prohibitions and restrictions of material world cannot do anything for the gopikas because bhagwan wants that what all you can just uh, remove from the pathway for my prema if in order to get my seva so that's why prabodhana saraswati pa speaking that when this kind of condition is coming in your life when this kind of condition will uh, stay in your life that like mad you will be running for the actual seva of bhagwan then you cannot stop that person from going towards bhagwan ahe to ke means that there is no condition at all why actually i am actually loving krishna there is not at all any condition involved in that there must be some uh, reason no for loving krishna but there is actually no reason apratiha apratihata means that you cannot stop that person to do the pre- prem bhakti of krishna jayatma su prasid to yahan jo jana this jana sthaya this is not a normal ordinary thing that those who are actually following bhagavad dharma and from inside the heart they have just taken the shelter of bhagavad dharma that what they will get bhagavad dharma ko aasai kar ke those just by taking the actual shelter of bhagavad dharma and you are actually just closing your eyes and just uh, running uh, forward then definitely uh, up till that point you will not at all get by you can get into falling condition because you have taken the ashray of bhagavad dharma and all kind of material restrictions and prohibitions that kind of other shacharan material other shacharan if you are if it it you have already quit that or left that it is up till that point also there are lot of uh, vidhan of shastras also even that also we have just left lok dharma ved dharma samaj dharma they nothing you uh, they will be uh, not at all touching you 
but that, uh, if you will be just speaking like that i have also taken that ashram ashram means just to take support that those who haven't taken support then ashram is very much important like that example i am giving that at night time when you are in the deep sleep that's a very dangerous barrier of the dam is just got broken and everyone actually is just flowing in that water everyone is just flooded all cats dogs and every person is just getting flooded by the water and all swami and his child everything has gone uh, into the water and there is no point of life there and in this condition that the, he, she has just grabbed one branch of uh, what briksh that tree what tree automatically one branch of a tree of a but what briksh that tree branch he she, tightly has just taken that in his hand and in any condition this kind of tree uh, she don't want to leave that so when after just uh, taking the actual shelter of the branch of that tree so what you have already just heard in english she is actually totally uh, unsupported no support at all just by taking that kind of support that all kind of with dharma means that what actually are the dharma actually is there written in the vedas you have to do this you have to do that lok dharma samaj dharma material dharma everything when actually you are getting rid of that then automatically nothing will get uh, uh, nothing will get vanquished in your life there will be no effect in your life bhagwan ji actually is speaking to uddhav that mat mat bhakti lakshan that this dharma that kind of anushthan that from the starting up till the end up till the end then uh, after uh, when it is actually manifested then lok dharma will automatically get destroyed that there is no kind of annavaiguna adi no kind of dosh or fault is there if you have actually followed bhagavad dar under if some kind of fault is also so you have done by fall while following that bhagavad dar then there is no kind of uh, uh, price chit required for that that lot that in the bhajan rajya that they also got some kind of mistake in this bhajan rajya but uh, the this is the actual uh, pratigya of bhagwan that if some very slight mistake has done okay there is no problem uh, something uh, reverse or opposite you have done and after that still uh, nothing will get uh, uh, wrong in your life maybe today or tomorrow or next life you will get definitely uh, find the actual rectification in your life you can see the case of vrittasur that uh, vritt means he is asur inside his body inside him that shuddha bhakti because his bhakti is not the actual uh, uh, actual vishay of uh, this body it is actually connected with atma vrittasur must have just done some kind of wrong thing but vrittasur that uh, in the body of a vritt also demon body he has this kind of uh, bhakti inside his heart just by seeing this indra just become mad indra speaking that how it is possible that you are actually asur you are in the body of asur that inside uh, you, inside uh, you that bhagavad dharma discussion is coming out from your mouth how it is possible the actual reason is that this vitrasur is actually is external body only just by the actual uh, uh, shrap of parvati but inside that bhakti is already there inside him externally he has just taken the vesh of demon external but inside his heart to topmost bhakti is there all the time and indra bhagwan actually speaking indra maharaj speaking that why you are how you are actually speaking that tatva gya vigyan and beautiful talking in front of me bhagwan ne bola and bhagwan speaking you see that just by taking the actual uh, shelter of my lotus feet if someone has just done some kind of small mistake also but still that kind of uh, uh, rectification he don't need to do that why because i have i will be maintaining that i will be maintaining that inside his heart i will be going inside his heart and i will be just making him i now will be maintaining that also 
दैट फॉर प्राइस चित फॉर इट इज नॉट एट ऑल रिक्वायर्ड फॉर एक्टिफिकेशन इज नॉट एट ऑल रिक्वायर्ड वॉट इट एक्चुअली इट्स रिटर्न इफ बाय चांस दैट समथिंग रॉन्ग हैज डन इन द पैथ वे ऑफ भजन एंड those who are very cruel persons for them it is not at all applicable the some cruel or so clever person is there that by his own will he is actually doing opposite it is not for him also it is definitely it is not at all applicable for him here actually what it actually written by chance kuch ho by chance if something happens that purposely is not at all doing i am taking sanyas and doing all kind of vyavichar and just by uh, brahmachari i am becoming a karmachari uh, i will not be uh, getting the actual result the opposite will happen in the vesh of brahmachari i am actually becoming karmachari then in the vesh of sanyas i will be becoming a bhogi it is not at all applicable for them they are all the time all the time he is doing opposite by his purposefully is doing opposite for this for that person that shlok is not this shlok is not applicable that inside our very bad dirty heart this kind of material desire all the time there that in which shastra and what shastra uh, that kind of uh, uh, um, is there any kind of proof in the shastra so that i can support the actual dirty material desires of mine this is just a normal uh, thinking of persons but this kind of the thing will not at all um, uh, get paired in the pathway of bhakti bhagwan can do only for those persons those who are not at all doing purposefully they don't have any kind of desire to do that but but this is just automatically it was done ishmay bola at that time it is written by chance it is done dono ti sarvam idi sannivishtu isko prashchit karne ka darkar nahi main for him rectification is not at all uh, done because i will be going inside his heart and make his heart uh, full soft and nirmal that is called that name is called vishwana chakravarti pad actually speaking जानो अस्थाई मीन एक्चुअल दैट दोज हैव टेकन द आश्रय ऑफ भागवत धर्म वॉट इज एक्चुअल वाइटल ऑफ टेकिंग आश्रय ऑफ भागवत धर्म विश्वनाथ चक्रवर्ती बात एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग दैट भागवत धर्म आश्रय मीन्स दैट स्पेशली यू जस्ट नीड टू टेक श्रवण कीर्तन एटसेट्रा डेफिनेटली दिस विल बी डन बट स्टिल दिस श्रवण कीर्तन स्मरण इट इज द मोस्ट वाइटल थिंग इन द वे ऑफ पैथ ऑफ भजन that is uh, shravan kirtan adi etc just by taking the ashray of bhagavad dharma if some uh, wrong has done in the uh, in between the way then definitely bhagwan will go inside the heart and will just destroy everything but the kind of desire we are actually just putting which is not at on there in shruti smriti and in the purans and shastra and just by his own will he is actually moving in the direction i can give you one example regarding this you can understand the point that our guru var what they have told us that according to the guru parampara that this kind of thinking we have that according to the guru parampara we have this kind of thinking that on the basis of our guru parampara we are having our shastra vichar and if someone actually is just questioning us that maharaj that datatre ji the tatre the actual pathway of the tatre what he has shown us or whether the actual pathway of rishabh dev that we can't take that up in our life how why 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 we are not taking he is bhagwan only yes he is bhagwan yes we know he is bhagwan but uh, the actual uh, the vichar of bhagwan is not like us the actual thinking of bhagwan is not like us 
that what kind of taste is there inside one person according to that he will be just going in that path where bhagwan is actually producing that kind of vichar that you can see that rishab dev that paramhans vichar is there he has actually left everything that uh, in his uh, on his mouth he has just uh, putting some stones and grains uh, uh, on his mouth so that's why that janya it is good no? so like this some person like this also they can just take because this whole world is colorful and different some can become buddhist and they can just take the vichar of buddha but uh, that buddha mai bhagwan what is there for us that kind of vichar we have to take and the other buddha is also there we don't need to take the vichar of that we have to take the vichar of that buddha which is mentioned in shrimad bhagavatam and if someone actually speaking that we we will take the vichar of parshuram that he is also bhagwan in punjab especially they are in parshuram jayanti is there all foolish number one they are actually just doing that i also went there and bharti maharaj was also there i was becoming very surprised that what kind of they don't have any kind of utsah for janmashtami ji krishna janmashtami utsav more utsah and more uh, happy they are feeling while following uh, uh, parshuram jayanti so what will be done by following that Huh? what will be done so that is a very topmost they are actually all pra- parakrami they want to be they don't want bhakti they actually want parakram position they want janma jayanti this word you can't use in each and every place it no it is not at all possible to use this word in each and every place for what purpose that our pitama bhishma that he is actually counted in the 12 mahajans dwadash mahajans परशुराम जी एक्चुअली ये ही एक्चुअली जस्ट रिजेक्टेड हिज गुरुदेव परशुराम एंड ही स्पीकिंग भीष्म देव those who are actually they are not at all taking the actual vichar of the shastras and whatever they are doing on their own that kind of gurudev we just need to leave that that is the topmost thing which is it is very much important to leave those kind of guru there but we are actually if we are actually taking shelter of kapat guru then still he we are thinking that he is our guru okay we have taken shelter so he is our guru only so this is foolishness so parshuram whether he is the actual avatar of bhagwan that is actual avatar of bhagwan parshuram we know in order to destroy khatriya he has just taken the power to destroy them that narad is actually uh, the avatar of bhakti shakti narad ji maharaj gyan shakti ka avatar and the gyan shakti avatar is uh, that kind of uh, dry dry gyan rishabh dev etc are actually the shakta vi avatar but in order to follow them what will happen It is, is it possible to follow them no not at all they are actually but krishna actually just by his own desire he is actually just doing that he, they are actually all against shuddha bhakti because there are also persons like that that we are finding that definitely we just need to take that uh, thing only and we have to stay like that but it's not like that because for each and every person it is different because bhagwan actually don't want to give bhakti to each and every person not at all possible narad ji maharaj actually speaking that bhagwan that bhagwan even mukti he will uh, provide but bhakti it is not possible he actually always used to hide the actual bhakti bhagwan always used to hide bhakti and don't want to give bhakti to each and every one because if bhakti is coming inside uh, someone then bhagwan actually just getting surrendered to that devotee it is already happened like that so that's why we just need to carefully understand this point that's why shri narottam das thakur ji our narottam das thakur ji has just uh, uh, made us cautioned and careful on to what point he has made us careful and cautioned he has cautioned us and he is speaking
that uh, our mahajans what kind of uh, pathway they are they are already all the time actually going in that pathway only but still there is one kind of uh, why is coming but there is actually but is there in that that purva par kriya vichar in this word everything is uh, there in the secret form that uh, purva jabar pralad maharaj is already there in the 12 mahajans lot of mahajans are there in 12 men they are actually basically basic dharm is bhagavad dharma so that's why we definitely have to follow them but that previous previous mahajans of ours and the present mahajans prabhupad bhakti nath thakur और वेद शिला रूप को स्वामी पाद शिला जीव को स्वामी पाद सनातन को स्वामी पाद ऑल एक्चुअली इन साइड द हार्ट ऑफ वॉट काइंड ऑफ हारमोनी इज देयर इन बिटवीन दैट वी जस्ट नीड टू टेक दैट इफ वी आर एक्चुअली एक्चुअली हैविंग द विचार ऑफ जीव को स्वामी रूप को स्वामी पाद देन वी कैन अंडरस्टैंड दैट पर वॉट प्रहलाद महाराज हैज टोल्ड वॉट प्रहलाद महाराज हैज टोल्ड that our bhajan pathway is totally different but basically they are actually following bhagavad dharma only that according to that only each and every person uh, uh, devotee i am actually paying that what on to lotus feet but narottam das thakur speaking that except the latest version जो हमको वॉट आर गुरु वर्ग हैज गिवन अस दैट वॉट गौरंग महाप्रभु आफ्टर गौरंग महाप्रभु दैट टॉप मोस्ट शिक्षा वी आर गेटिंग इंस्ट्रक्शन फ्रॉम गेटिंग दैट बाई टेकिंग दैट ओनली दैट प्रहलाद महाराज विल गेट इफेक्टेड बाई दैट विल गेट डिसरिस्पेक्टेड इट इज नॉट लाइक दैट चैतन्य महाप्रभु द विचार वॉट हैज टोल्ड टू अस चैतन्य महाप्रभु विचार इज दिस एंड चैतन्य महाप्रभु विचार इन ऑर्डर टू जस्ट टेक दैट दिस विचार इज वेरी मच इम्पॉर्टेंट दैट टू गो टू प्रहलाद महाराज इट इज नॉट ऑफ यूज नो सो टू विच पर्सन वी हैव टू गो फॉर दैट रीजन इट इज रिटर्न देयर How actually it is written? First, what is told here? Mahaprabhu Shri Chaitanya. So you see, so nicely it is written there. What actually it is written? महाप्रभु इज द एक्चुअल पैथवे शोन बाय महाप्रभु महाप्रभु इज इंस्ट्रक्शन दैट इज दैट इज सुपर फाइन इट मीन्स प्रहलाद महाराज इज ऑल्सो ओके इट्स इन भागवतम बट टू गो अप टिल दिस पॉइंट इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल इवन आफ्टर मिलियंस ऑफ लाइफ प्रहलाद महाराज महाराज इज ओके बट महाप्रभु एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग दैट दोज इंस्ट्रक्शन दैट इज सो मच सुपर फाइन that inside vrindavan that under the guidance of prajvasis radharani is under radharani is parshad this actually super fine vichar is there so for any person which kind of bhav is exhibiting it's not like mahaprabhu has already told that raganuga bhakti but inside the heart of those persons that automatically opposite bhav is coming that uh, in 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 vrindavan in order to get manifest in vrindavan is very much difficult that kind of vrindavan bhav inside your mentally mentally it will be very possible not possible to come whether it is shant bhav whether it is vatsalya ras whatever ras is there madhur ras sakhya ras any kind of ras it is it is you are actually not allowed to enter into that there is no approval given on to that because it is very impossible to get into that bhava of vrindavan and yesterday i have told that in madhur ras every ras is there in madhur ras so like this it is told 
so here that shravan kirtan that is actually the vital thing top most vital and our in our bhajan if something is anukul and something is pratikul something neutral uh, vishay can also be there that point is there in bhakti rasamrit sindhu i have already told uh, previously long before this point just by speaking anukul if actually is something he is thinking that there is no pratikul in it if someone actually making one meaning that in some vishay that there is no pratikulya for in the bhajan pratikulyam pratikulya is uh, means that anukul is also not there it doesn't mean like that so those who are neutral ni- neither they are anukul nor they are pratikul so that is actual neutral platform means so this uh, that prancharatra sector shruti shriti vichar whatever vichar is there that is the actual i etiquette and vishist those who are actually speaking about the special bhakti it is already described here on the basis of that in order to just get that if we are following that in toto that we are following parshuram or we are actually trying to follow rishabh dev dadatre ji then okay they are good okay i am not uh, disrespecting them but still so but there is actually no point of shuddh bhakti in it if he will be doing that then automatically destruction will come in his bhakti life in all the four directions and now actually the question is coming vishuna chakravarti pad speaking if some shastra shasan mein if in some shastra shasan na humne se if he is not at all doing the pravritti and if some person according to the shastra shasan and the strict rules and regulations of the shastras he is not at all following that with strict rules and regulations shastra shasan kab tak hai when these regulations are there of the shastras it means it it is up till that that greediness is not at all uh, established inside your heart up till that point when the greed greediness comes that you, according to the rules and regulation of the shastra you just need to go okay you are actually following the strict rules and regulations before but when after getting the greediness also in order to get that uh, greediness towards a particular object that kind of uh, rules and regulation of shastra are still very important you can't leave that if you will be just leaving all the strict rules and regulations of the shastra then he is going to the uh, this uh, point that i have already established greediness to a particular object okay now i can throw all the strict rules and rules and regulations then he can't understand that up till what object he has to go and how to achieve that particular object he don't have any this kind of uh, understanding that this kind of incident also has done in vindavan as well in govardhan at the at the bank of mansi ganga shiddh krishna das baba ji maharaj he used to stay there and he has and some baba actually used to come and that baba is very nice baba so much humble and so much topmost patience he has that and he is so good and so humble that he used to come to uh, baba ji maharaj and that village i just forgot that uh, where you have to go towards chata one actually going towards chata and if you from radha kund and govardhan if you are going then another way actually is just going towards the pali gaon pali village after that you just need to cross that and then you have to go ahead and after that there is a close to nand gaon one village in that way only there is one village i can't remember the name of the village now i can remember but it's uh, i am at present i am not remembering that baba what he has done that he always used to go to krishna das baba ji maharaj for his darshan so that in order to get some instructions of bhajan baba ji maharaj always used to do kripa on him ranwari ranwari gaon yeah, i can now remember ranwari village yes i just remember it now so this actually baba automatically immediately he has just uh, come in the association of some pure guru vaishnav and he is uh, he is actually just went for the 
फॉर तीर्था डिफरेंट डिफरेंट तीर्था इज गोइंग एंड ही एक्चुअली जस्ट वेंट विद दोज साधु एंड स्टोरी स्टैंडिंग एंड गोइंग टू ऑल द तीर्था ही जस्ट वेंट टू एट एट द लास्ट इन द्वारका ऑल्सो ही वेंट इन द्वारका ऑल्सो ही वेंट एंड इन द्वारका वॉट ही हैज डन दैट देयर देयर ही हैज डन परिक्रम एवरी थिंग ही हैज डन देयर एंड आफ्टर दैट देर इज सम काइंड ऑफ स्टैम्प दैट हॉट स्टैम्प ऑन द हॉट स्टैम्प ऑन द बॉडी यू आर पुटिंग विच इज परमानेंट ही ऑलरेडी हैज डन दैट एंड आफ्टर दैट ही जस्ट केम बैक टू ब्रज एंड आफ्टर दैट वेन ही केम बैक देन आफ्टर दैट वेन कृष्ण दास बाबा जी महाराज एक्चुअली ही जस्ट वेन टू कृष्ण दास बाबा जी महाराज देन ही सॉ दैट देर इज हॉट स्टैम्प ऑन द बॉडी डिफरेंट डिफरेंट पार्ट्स and uh, he become real krishna das baba ji maharaj actually speaking that now you are are uh, not under the under the lotus feet of radharani you can't do bhajan of the lotus feet of radharani at all now because you have just gone to dwarka under the guidance of rukmini and satyabama you have done the bhajan now you now it is not possible for you to get the lotus feet of radharani and just by mistake he uh, just left everything eating drinking everything he left this sadhu that that all those prajmandals uh, sadhu in that it is actually there that is the actual story fact it is not a story and in the eternal parshad when he is thinking that to go to radharani she can't he can't go then with the topmost bire fire inside his heart separation fire of separation he just uh, and after so much days when all those prajwasis seeing the, uh, that uh, they just uh, break the door of the house and they seeing that up till this throat his whole body is just on fire just like you can see the charcoal no charcoal is just like on in fire actually is getting similarly his body up till throat has all been actually uh, done with the done and done and dust with fire but we are actually in bonded condition cannot believe that so whatever is the case if someone actually is getting not at all uh, g- giving restriction to himself uh, under the shastras and uh, that kind of nij bhav maybe you have to go pratikul that that dwarka dhyan etc you have to do this uh, hot stamp etc all this kind of acharan you just need to forget if you will be doing that then automatically that is not at all good for uh, raganuga bhajan it is not at all good that uh, is not at all good to follow so that's why in this case strict strict rules and regulation of the shastra should also you should not uh, throw that because after if you will throw that then automatically you will be doing bhajan by your own independence by your using your own liberty and independence you will be doing the bhajan that in order to get into rag mark he, it cannot be possible even by vidhi mark also just by doing seva under vidhi mark slowly steadily if he is getting that siddhi in dwarika pur also but then definitely he will be counted in the dwarka mahishi gans like there is one case of mira bai our mira is not bai she is not from our sampraday but still i am giving an example she has done actually done bhajan in vrindavan and uh, all the time that girdhari lal that is girdhari lal is mine and no one is else in my life mira bai is actually she is speaking like that all the time all the time she is actually serving giriraj maharaj and used to uh, write very nice kirtan and uh, sing songs but at the last at the time of getting siddhi she got siddhi in dwarka mira bai ji just went to dwarka she got the kripa of bhagwan definitely but radharani is anugatya she hasn't done she has done her own uh, uh, bhajan according to her Uh, when you will not be doing the anugatya prajvasis up till that point raganuga raganuga bhajan upanuga bhajan is not at all possible this is the actual speciality of this bhajan apart from that there is no other pathway open for you whatever will be the case whatever whosoever will be that for each and every one no pathway is open apart from this that raganuga devotee that is the actual pathway under the guidance of prajvasis you need to follow and there is no other pathway open 
वेदर वॉट एवर वी दूस एवर ही विल बी मीरा भाई जी दैट शी हैज नॉट डन द अनुगत श्रीमती राधा रानी एंड गोपिका दैट्स वाई दैट होल लाइफ दैट्स वाई होल लाइफ दैट माई माई इज ओनली गिरिधारी एंड आई डोंट हैव एनी वन अपार्ट फ्रॉम गिरिराज माँ बट शी डिडेंट गॉट एनी फ्रूट Why? The final fruit she has she hasn't got because she hasn't done the anugatya of Brajvasis, no. So that's why. So that is so like this about Lakshmi Devi. Also, this kind of vichar is there. Lakshmi Devi about that that same vichar is there. Lakshmi Devi actually up till now. Nanda Nanda Krishna's lotus feet she hasn't got up till now. Up till now, she hasn't got the lotus feet of Nandan because Lakshmi Devi in Bella one. Because up till today, in Bella one, this kind of this actually she is doing Lakshmi Devi is doing bhajan in Bella one like that. Up till now also, she is calling Krishna Nandan. She hasn't got the darshan of Nandan Nandan Krishna. Why? Because she actually wants to do the bhajan or an or on her own, she is not at all taking the uh, shelter of Radha Rani. Bella one in Vinda is in Vinda one. Why? Because she hasn't done the anugatya of Radha Rani. Why? Because I am Lakshmi. Why I will do the anugatya of Radha Rani? This kind of ego is there, positive ego itself, but still it's ego. Okay, she is not at all doing Radha Rani anugatya, and up till now also she hasn't uh, got any kind of. Uh, she has got any kind of darshan of krishna and in the 10th canto it is written in shrimad bhagavatam tavan mere nu sparsha dikhar jag vanchaya shri lalaya lalanaya charak tapu bihayu kama nu suchiram dikha prata aaj tak bhi up till this today only lakshmi devi ko lakshmi devi nandan nandan krishna's lotus feet is she is not at all getting she not got the association of nandan nandan krishna it is not at all possible the for so like that reason that there are lot of uh, secret points in the bhajan and uh, by my will i can't do this much vidhi mark ke dara by vidhi mark what is the actual uh, pathway open for vidhi mark rag mark is not all there rag mark and vidhi mark it's uh, uh, only adhikar of brajvasis only only vidhi mark That he has just taken the shelter of Vidhi Maharaj, and in order to do sadhan according to that, then in that case, that definitely will get the Dwarka Puri Mahishis, and you will become the servant of the Dwarka Rishis and Mahishis. And if if some mixing comes, that mixture, that ragatmik with ragatmik sadhan, there is some kind of Vidhi Maharaj. Is is actually mixed, so it is not at all possible to get mixed. So if in Mathura Dam all those Mahishi guns, on all into all parikars, you will get the place. Maybe it, uh, slightly here there, there yeah, Vidhi Mark is there, but Rag Mark is also there. Some mix, mixing is there. There is actually milk and water mixing. So it's something happens like this in my uh, mixing. Then just by doing the uh, Vidhi Mark bhajan. Slowly, steadily, he will be getting the relationship with Krishna, and she is actually loving Krishna a lot, and she that she is actually staying in Mathura. So, like this, they are actually changing Priti with Bhagwan, and if they are actually thinking like same like them, then definitely, if I will be speaking about uh, Ragamarg and Vidhi Marg, I will be mixing it, and if someone actually mixing both the Siddhant Vijar. Then uh, all those Mathura Dam, those all Mahishi guns are there. If they are doing this kind of uh, commentary, then it is not at all acceptable at all. Why? Because there is actually no question regarding this like that. So like this, uh, lot of questions are coming here, but still doubt is there. The first thing is that. The first thing is that. भगवान श्री कृष्ण का जो विवाह है इधर तो नहीं हुई नहीं इस मैरिज इट इज नॉट एट ऑल डन हियर 
Rukmani, etc. They have done oh, marriage with Krishna, as and as there is a lot of vichar regarding this. And if someone is doing something mixing, definitely something can be done in that. As so, lot of vichar is there. Kupja, you can see that uh, if some that someone asking that Kupja Devi is also serving Krishna. And uh, if you are thinking the same as that platform as Gopikas, then the opposite reverse reaction will come in that. So it's not like the Gopikas how so Gopikas are serving Krishna. It is different from the Gopikas how Kubja is serving. So after inside Raganuga Bhakti, some kind of limbs of Bhakti, according to which uh, Bhajan Anga and which, how to do Bhajan Anga and how to follow that Bhakti procedure, how it is like and how we have to step forward in the bhajan life and uh, what is the actual what is my actual duty and what is my actual swarup this actually all kind of vichar this it is very much important to understand in this life only why because there are uh, five kind of bhajan procedure there one is vishay that second is that according to your own avishta bhavna that kind of particular avishta you are actually going away you will be just transforming into krishna sadhan and this ishta bhav sambandhi this is nij avishta bhav mai that is nij avishta bhav is actually is in relationship with something and the, this nij avishta bhavanukul that it that is actually on the neutral platform it is not at all good and it is not at all bad also that nij abhishta bhav that is the actual fine form that all these details if you are not at all getting then definitely you can go into the opposite direction of this there is no doubt about it All, all, all reverse will happen in that opposite will happen so those who are actually avishta bhavna that those who are full of avishta avishta relationship and what is actually in a cool for nij avishta bhav in order to get into our heart that neutral platform should be there so that which is not pratikul and not at all pratikul that is neutral that is very much essential to have so in all these vishayas so all in all these vishayas Vishwanath Chakravarti was speaking that inside that some some things are there though those who are very sad, sadhya and some are actually have to do sadhan regarding that so one procedure is here actually is told that there some kind of bhav is also like that that uh, sadhya and sadhan that the both automatically get uh, uh, in sadhan and sadhya is all the same only only in the there is a fixed form and is a temporary uh, situation that uh, fixed temporary and permanent situation three situations are there so in this way just in all these vishayas that there is one kind of process, special procedure that in which uh, that uh, what is written in the shastras that whatever you are getting in the sadhan at the time of doing sadhan and it is at the time of sadhya it is all the same so there is no kind of uh, uh, hard and fast things and other things are also there that the sadhu and prem that kind of uh, upadan karan you have to understand some things are there that just by understanding that we have to uh, actually take the target in our life particular target so we have to do the the shastra shastra in the sh- we have to do the upadan of all the shastra it means that uh, just by doing anushinal of that 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 prem krishna prem target we will reach someday so that's why golok is the actual sadhya swarup of upadan Karya, and there is some kind of limit the karan as well and just by so thinking that it is not all upadan karan this is actually nimit karan so it can be done like that as well and some kind of bhajan procedure also like that those 
those who are actually the chin swarup of bhajan and there is actually some kind of indication some remarkable indication some actually are very nice upakarak that i can just uh, help you some are apakarak they are do it those who are doing all against those who are actually neutral they are not at all doing wrong neither doing right N- neither they are upakarak neither they are apakarak so all these kind of things are there you have just need to have a with total careful vichar on it vishnu chabudwa ji ne bataya vishnu chabudwa ji speaking dasho shakho ye jo hai dasya sakya all the sector all these uh, rasa that is like the actual sadhya sadan ro dasya sakya that shri guru padashre from guru padashre up to that uh, dhyan etc argument logical interpretation cannot stand which stand but there are some kind of procedure of bhajan that they are actually bhav sambandhit guru pad padma is when you are taking shelter of guru pad padma and you are taking mantra and all those dhyan and stimul uh, that uh, with full careful uh, careful mood you are actually following those bhajanam and some bhajanam are also like that that according to the shraddha prem that kind of topmost upadan cause just by speaking that they are actually making it uh, relate, related to my bar they are actually uh, making relation with my heart so this you can just speak like that each and every day that uh, in our uh, topmost ananya uh, chit each and every day we have to do uh, have to do jap in the with a pure mind and body so each and every day we have to do that so that is nija vist that is the actual duty of ours we this is the natural duty we have to do that the jap and everything so all these uh, this in ganodesh deepika it is already written there in ganodesh deepika it is this kind of remark is already siddhant is, is in the form of siddhant here it is written that in siddh swarup those people they who are actually doing anusaran of brajwasis it is very much important to anusaran of the brajwasis we have to do that for them when you are doing mantra jap etc and slowly steadily by doing mantra jap definitely they also need to have the darshan why because uh, under the guidance of some anugatya of a brajwasi we have to get a particular swarup and bhav and just by speaking the upadan karan you are actually getting relationship established with krishna so it's a very uh, complex uh, and a big uh, vishay it in order to just go more deep into it you can't think that think of that so that's why i'm speaking because it is actual uh, instructions of prabhupad so that kind of nij abhishta bhav that krishna naam mantra jap etc all these things you just need to follow naturally it means that slowly steadily by doing naam mantra in this vishay that shri krishna naam maha mantra sankirtan hari katha etc in this vishay i'll be just discussing that in ganur gadesh dipika one meaning of this is like that in gaur ganur gadesh dipika on this vishay some uh, point is actually discussed here where that in the word govind means go that some person is thinking go is cow no it's not like that go is that indriyo our sense organs go window those who are actually, who is actually controlling that that's why our sense organs are speaking rishikesh who is actually the controller and master of all the sense organs here go means गौरगनोज दीपिका गौरगनोज दीपिका इट इज रिटर्न पुरुषकल दैट इट इज इंद्रिय सकल रिलेटेड टू सेंस ऑर्गन ओनली गो एक्चुअली जस्ट वेरिएटेड हेयर दैट ऑल दो गोपी जन वल्लभ आवर विचार इज लाइक दैट दैट गो मीन्स आवर सेंस ऑर्गन एंड इन ऑर्डर टू जस्ट 
we have to just uh, go up to the more up to the level of the our, our sense organs lift ourselves that gopi jan vallab who is the actual vallab of all the gopikas that kind of exclusive bhav is already there inside them just in order to save that kind of bhav that is the actual uh, work of gopi jan vallab krishna that's why that gopastri vallab that so krishna how actually is getting with the man so whatever the sense organs of gopikas and his heart actually krishna has just separated and categorized their heart and has just hypnotized their heart so that they are thinking of krishna all the time it means that whatever kind of yog vichar is there inside their heart that uh, in brahm samhita vichar it is uh, already written that what is the actual bhav of the gopikas in order to just protect that that is the actual role of gopijan vallabh it means that nijas nid nid nij abhishth sa relationship with the krishna naam jap etc and mahamant is very much important to do you can't leave that that's why according to that shri chaitanya chaitamrit that in the astadat that in the astadat word akshar and in the dashashwar mantra that is by speaking that mantra if this kind of vichar you are taking from the shastra just by this word only what i have already told you in brief yes previously that astadat akshar mantra and dwadash akshar mantra both actually are ved mantra and shivanand sen and sektra used to do astadash and dash akshar mantra this both both the mantras are actually topmost and by this mantra only there is by only by this mantra that kaam giji kaam bijan kaam gayatri we can do the bhajan of our nandanandan bhajan apart from that not at all possible just by kaam gayatri and kaam bij so those were actually established in yogpeet vrindavan by them only just by this flowers and fruits you are offering that is okay it is good but what is the actual aradhana that is what is the actual aradhana regarding that that is nij abhishth of krishna that shri krishna ka naam roop leela prakriti that according to that nij bhav that whatever kind of bhav i am actually want to become siddha that kind of siddha bhav i want that shri krishna's naam roop gun leela etc just want to hear that it definitely it is very much important to do and after that it is called upadan karan it is upadan upadan karan you have to do upadan karan means means that it is actually called bhav sambandhi it is related to bhav still it's an upadan karan but still it is actually related to bhav shila vishwana jagarti pad speaking that if you just need to uh, Uh, separate your lajja quit your lajja and you are just doing the roop madhurja singing and remembering krishna according to the shastras then this vrat etc a lot of things you are doing just to satisfy krishna it means that what kind of uh, so if you will be doing other kind of association then they can be a barrier in your actual bhajan so in order to just quit that kind of association that all kind of naam roop gun deela everything will get manifest he has to do continuously like that and you have to do the bhakt sang those all devotees bhagwan tumhara chahiye that bhagwan will be uh, doing the karke parmanand la you will be getting the parmanand lag after by doing the shravan kirtan smaran of bhagwan's leela gun etc so this is the actual uh, by this proof of practical proof of the shastras that whatever sadhan uh, which is actually bhav sambandhi related to bhav all the time it is you just need to do all the time it is not at all good to stop all this sadhan raganuga in raganuga bhajan then what the actual mukhya bhav in raganuga bhajan 
that in that some major uh, um, limbs are there and some are actually partial limbs in this raganuga bhajan there is actually uh, main major limbs and there are some partial limbs of sadhana this that kirtan shravan smaran they are actually the major uh, limbs it means that smaran kirt apart from living smaran kirtan that mukhya ang major ang you limb you cannot perform and that's why that uh, just because of that uh, it is very much important to do that is called major limbs in this kaliyug that kirtan anga that kirtan anga adhikari in this uh, present kaliyug especially in this kaliyug each and every object in each and every kaliyug sankirtan is very much important in every kaliyug but especially in this kaliyug there is one speciality that uh, because this kali yuga is very much dangerous and in each and every yuga sankirtan is the top most uh, uh, sadhan and sadhya vastu that's why in this kali yuga shriman mahaprabhu has just told that in this present uh, kali yuga that kirtan smaran bhajan is uh, everyone has the eligibility to do so vishuna chakravarti was speaking those who want to do the anushiran of bhajan as for that he, he has to take the shelter of naam sankirtan and guru vishnu in order to just get the just by in order to get the association of the naam sankirtan without naam sankirtan whatever kind of kriya you are doing that will become karma it will not be bhakti so that's why in this present kali yuga kirtan ang that is the topmost sadhana and sadhya tatva you just need to take this is actually one reason behind that that in bhakti marg that topmost sarva shastra for each and every shastra nanavido kirtaneshu sri krishna so nanavido kirtaneshu tan naam sankirtana meva moksham sankirtani sabse that sankirtan is the topmost the rudwan din wali etc all this can we don't have the eligibility to read but she la vishnu chakravarti pad has just given us the proof from there that there is actually very in depth which are in that we don't have the adhikar to read it now then in this granth she la vishnu vishnu chakravarti pad speaking that those who are actually doing the association of gopikas shruti shruti in usually in very lot of things are there regarding this but we don't have this adhikar to just uh, understand that slight uh, uh, kind of proof i am giving in front of you in ujwali uh, mali granth that with full shraddha and with full tapasya bhav that in order to get the topmost prem he has got the birth in uh, braj dham that is the actual uh, praman lot of examples are there regarding this which is the actual procedure you, you will be going through like in the in the 10th canto of shrimad bhagavad gita mahapuran there is uh, one uh, example in that example that about by the shrutis there is one uh, uh, by all those shrutis they are actually glorifying there is one personified form of glorification of krishna or uh, to krishna they are actually just personifying bhagwan they are actually at that time they are uh, will actually just get manifest and samasamadisho bhi saroj hum log thakur ji that we all people o oh prabhu we just need to take the honey of the lotus feet by the guidance of all the gopikas that in front of bhagwan the actual uh, anugatya of gopikas bhagwan cannot uh, leave that so in ujwali rali we don't have this kind of vichar uh, adhikar 
and Vishnu Chakravarti was speaking that and the usual that kind of topmost shraddha you should first develop and you, after just uh, doing tapasya for a long time just by getting that topmost frame in your life that you just need to take birth in and take a virbhav in brajadam from some gopis you can take that and this kind of uh, actual uh, examples exemplary things are there according to this practical proof on the basis of this practical proof what you can uh, uh, prove according to this you can prove that that whatever uh, that by this t- doing tapasya with full prema you can get uh, krishnas because you just need to do for satisfaction like brahma ji has done tapasya brahma ji has done lot of tapasya brahma ji after just doing tapasya in chatush loki bhagavatam and in brahm samhita also there is this this kam gayatri brahma has got from uh, bhagwan so all these kind of mysteries are there how to do that so prem just by getting that prem that what is actually there the actual praman of shastras according to that praman that all those gopikas that kind of uh, tapasya what you are doing in order to get prem bhakti after that only you can get that so in this uh, present kali yug there is no other kind of tapasya strict rules and regulation written in kali kal because in this kali kal our naam sankirtan is prabhupada always used to speak this point prabhupada speaking that our because in this kali kal sankirtan is called the mahadhyan sankirtan prabhupada speaking that hari kirtan is the topmost mahadhyan in this kali kal so there is one prescription in satyuk what kind of prescription is given prabhupada speaking that hari kirtan there is actually no other kind of separate dhyan only hari kirtan is topmost dhyan and in treta yug and in uh, you can see that complete dhyan by sankirtan when you are getting complete dhyan it means and after that by doing that slowly steadily we can see that in treta yug that uh, actually this uh, yagya yagya vidhan is there and uh, yagya is actually naam sankirtan that uh, that uh, that kind of yagya what you have to do in treta yug that is the topmost preliminary fruit you will get uh, in the way of bhakti so this actually this is hari naam sankirtan can also do that in dwapar yug by what archan actual uh, vidhan is there before that that uh, kind of actual fruit how you will get just by naam sankirtan so hari naam sankirtan is very much essential Prabhupada actually speaking that that Kirtan is the Mahayagya, Sankirtan is the topmost Maha Archan, everything is in Naam Sankirtan. Everything by Sankirtan you can get. So, in Ujjwal Neenmadi also, what actually Vishnu Chakra was speaking that with full Shraddha, all Shruti Ganja actually just praying. So, we also have to do Tapasya like that, just on the basis of that, this, that how we can get a similar Prem Bhakti like Gopi was, that in Vartaman, present Kali Yuga, there is no other uh, Tapasya uh, possible for us. There is no question of doing other kind of Tapasya. There is no other pathway of or uh, strict rules and regulations you can follow in this Kali Yuga just by taking shelter of Naam Sankirtan. That is the only uh, shelter. So what actually tapasya is called? So whatever you are uh, doing for Bhagwan, Ekadishi, etc. All kind of rules and regulations you are uh, taking for the satisfaction of Bhagwan, and for separately for yourself you are not doing anything. For Gaudiya Samaj, there is actually not any kind of separate uh, tapasya method. 
at all we need to follow our ekadashi we just need to follow like that that our ekadashi janmashtami etc all we need to follow that ekadashi janmashtami etc that is actually comes in tapasya only that bhagwan ji this vichar is there that's why ekadashi janmashtami etc in the form of tapasya we have to do but it will become uh, the nimitta karan it is not the pradhan karan it is actually nimitta karan so according to this that that our nitya and nimittik uh, karma what we are actually performing the, if we are actually not performing that then definitely uh, we will get the disadvantage nitya and nimittik uh, Uh, karma by not performing them that nitya sandhya mandan etc naam sankirtan that is all actually it will be stopping that then definitely we will we have to just suffer for that why because because about this in the shastra it is already written you definitely want to get some punishment also that's why this kind of top most strict which are is given that's why that kind of nittata that he want don't want to do that so in the smriti shastra that ekadashi vrat in the smriti shastra ekadashi vrat that in the vipaksh of ekadashi vrat how to do ekadashi vrat in the shiti shastra that the uh, in the relation to ekadashi how to that ekadashi vrat how to do that in relation to that how to do that ekadashi but that kind of govind smaran if you are not doing and you will be doing ekadashi by just leaving govind sankirtan then you will not be uh, find the actual uh, actual uh, uh, actual fruit of the fast upavas means doesn't mean that you just that you will not be taking anything it's not like that what do you mean it doesn't mean of upavas doesn't mean that without eating i'll be just staying upavas upavas means that i vas means we i have to stay close to bhagwan very very close to bhagwan i have to stay that is called upavas that just to stay close to bhagwan very close to bhagwan just uh, i have just uh, stopped taking prasadam it is not like that it bhagwan actually speaking that for me if some kind of krit that krit vrat that is actually tapasya that shri kadashi janmashtami etc whatever you are doing all actually you are performing that will become the nimitta karan and nitya and nimitta karan i have always told all already told you and in the smriti shastra also it is written that ek in ekadashi vrat that in the vidhi paksh of ekadashi that you just need to fast on ekadashi it is very much important necessary but why you are actually doing that in order to that actual vital thing in that that shri govind smaran if it is not at all there then actually it is of no value that's why in the smriti shastra that upadan karan along with that in order to get the smaran uh, limb of bhakti that ekadashi is very much important to do in anshik in very fine form if we'll be speaking that in fine form that uh, actually it is relationship with the, all those uh, that bhav sambandhi uh, we just need to get that bhav bhakti inside our heart and those people who are not at all doing ekadashi vrat those who are not at all following ekadashi vrat for them it is actually written here that they are matri hanta pitri hanta guru hanta they will become it's already written in the skanda puran they will be just going against all kind of uh, uh, this things if some is a very small child he can't do ekadashi at all but ekadashi is very much essential to do for a small child as well so those who don't want to do ekadashi vrat for them he will become matri hanta pitri hanta guru hanta 
all this kind of hanta will just follow them in skanda puran it is already given proof regarding this it means that by this vachan we can understand that guru hanta that top most sinful uh, pap sinful uh, dangerous sinful uh, pap you are doing that you just by taking that on your head that uh, your your life will become more and more uh, dangerous so by this kind of matri shavan that nama prad will definitely get in your life by this kind of dangerous things that by this patak nama prad will definitely get uh, will increase in your life and by nama prad you can't do actual bhajan at all so in this way in vishnu dharmotra bachan about brahmatya sura pai it is uh, for uh, the rectification how to do that is already written there written there about that but in ekadashi just you are taking uh, grains in that automatically you will uh, put on sinful activities in your life you are just taking uh, kidnapping someone or you are uh, drinking wine and you are taking the wife of guru different different kind of punishments and some rectification different different rectifications are there regarding this but those who have just taken prasadam in ekad grains in ekadashi then definitely he will be getting destruction in his bhakti life this sinful activity cannot get destroyed so that's why it is very very dangerous so that's why so this this is the actual vichar of all the shastra that is why in ekadashi vrat etc that what kind of kriya karma definitely you need to perform those duties if you will be just leaving those duty then nothing will happen so this is so much fine form even actually top most matured form that everything they just need to follow on this vishay tomorrow i will also be just discussing because because i am tomorrow is ekadashi and i will be just discussing about the glorification of ekadashi what is a very in depth vishay there and we just need to discuss that and if i will not be discussing then the actual point we will uh, Uh, just gonna leave that so today I just forgive me i'll be discussing it tomorrow yahan tak charcha ka up till this point i will be just giving rest